Buzz Eva Heard, welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. Uh, my phone is ringing. What's going on? Hello, this is Timmy from Nook's Cranny. I've reached Zebra, right? Yep, we've sent a payment to your bank account for 128 bells for what you left in the drop-off box. Oh yeah, that's right, I forgot about that. Uh, thank you for using this service. Hope to see you in the, in the shop soon. I think that was for like a couple of flowers or something. Interesting, well, Rolf should be moved in for today, so that'll be cool. We also have Nook Shopping, KK Soul. Uh, we have Jolly Reds, of course, that is the painting we purchased. On behalf of all of us here at Jolly Reds Treasure Trawler, I'd like to thank you for your wise and, if I may add, final purchase of the tremendous statue enclosed. Uh, please come again, no refunds, red owner and resident, or president. Um, and then Nook Incorporated, a new resident has moved into the plot you said that should be a thousand miles, very cool. So yeah, I'm glad to get some of that stuff done. Uh, we will definitely uh, register the KK Soul. We will donate the uh, Tremendous Statue, which of course we can always place down and take a look at. Awesome. Uh, so yeah, that should be a lot of fun, uh, being able to say hi to Rolf now that he's moved in. I think he is our ninth villager, right? So we might have one more left we can find. Maybe we'll do that in today's episode. Maybe we won't, just have to depend on what we what else we see around today. Uh, but yeah, it should be pretty cool getting everything. I'll go, 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 go figure out uh, Blathers first with this uh, statue. Just because, you know, it might just be good to get out of the way. Hello. Ooh. Okay, so I have a statue for you. Yep, I know the stamp rally. It's exactly the same, but you always have to explain it every day. Okay, so talk to you again. Make a donation. I'm going to donate a tremendous statue. I hope you find it tremendous. Ooh, what is that tremendous statue? And the genuine article, no less? Yes, it is indubitably. It is even more magnificent than I imagined. I shall treat this donation with the utmost care. I was honor. I shall also leave details about your donation for all to read once it's on display. Ooh, please do check back later. All right, very cool. Um, So that's gonna be it for right now. Jolly good, please enjoy the rest of your visit. We are going to uh, head out. We'll see if there's anything. It looks like there's no fruit coming into any of the trees just yet. There might be some in the little orchard that we made up uh, on the top left, but I'm just sort of taking a look around, you know, get some fossils and stuff. We'll also, not fossils, but, uh, oh, eventually, hopefully, but that was a coral, not a fossil. I also want to see what Nook Miles we have today. Um, so we have to talk to friends, we need to get some fossils assessed, hit rocks, complete DIY projects, catch fish. So overall, pretty simple stuff. We should be able to do that, no problem. Um, wrong thing. I'm gonna keep the uh, shovel out for now so that if we find any fossil spots or if we find or run into any of the rocks, which we definitely know where all those are, so it shouldn't be hard to find them exactly. Uh, but yeah, just gonna be taking a look around, seeing how things go. I'll set up this right there, and we'll get started with our first rock. Yeah, I don't know which one will end up being the money rock, but sooner or later we'll find it. Also, if we can find any villagers out and about, it looks like both Pashmina and uh, Kyle are not here right now. They're both outside of their homes. But there we go, we already got the Nook Miles done for hitting the rock. So that'll be a quick and easy 200 miles. Very nice. And catch a bagworm, okay. If I see any bagworms, I'll certainly get them, but for those, I do need to uh, shake some trees, so. Maybe I'll switch over to the net for right now so that if we do run into one, because that's like, a, if we can find one, it's a pretty simple 300 miles. Right now we're getting some sticks and stuff, but I think I only need to shake it once to see if there's a bagworm. I'm sure there's one around now. I don't know if they show up on fruit trees. We'll stick to normal trees, just like this. Got that stick. And definitely some more shells. We're looking for a message in a bottle to get more DIY recipes. Oh, here's Kyle. Hey, Kyle. Ciao, Alpha. Let's talk. Clear sky, smooth sailing. Living the dream, Zebra. Me too. Yo, you wanna chat? I don't blame you, Alpha. What's the latest? I heard through, through the orange vine that you've been excavating a ton of fossils lately, Alpha. I always wonder what kind of designer clothes those ancient creatures like to wear. I'm sure that, you know, I can imagine a T-Rex in like a nice top hat. That seems fitting. I have this stone, I think I dropped this earlier. Ooh, another violin bug. We've already gotten this one before, but we might as well oh, get it again. Cool. Yep, there's a violin beetle. Okay, well that was pretty good. And I think Roth is living, yeah, up where Lionel is. Okay, money from the tree, but wait a minute, who are you? Hello? Kicks, welcome. Well, well, what do we have here? Haven't you seen your face before? Her name's Kix. 
You might have already guessed it, but I'm the source for shoes, socks, and bags around here. Really? I swing by this island once weekly. I've never seen you before. Have you been showing up every week and I've missed you every single time? What what day is it? I don't know, what weekday? Uh, I look forward to seeing you around, new chum, all right, all right. Uh, if it's all right with you, why not take a look-see of my offerings on this fine day? <laughs> Lionel singing. Okay, so you sell shoes. Do you have a full store we could end up getting? Oh, I like these bags out. So we have babooshes, cleats, embroidered shoes, back bow socks, uh, color blocked socks, um, frilly knee high socks, town backpack, square backpack, uh, cloth shoulder bag, faux fur bag, and crossbody Boston bag. I like the Boston bag, that looks pretty cool. Um, I haven't seen a bag like that in the game, so why don't we go ahead and try to buy that and see just what the experience is like here. I might wanna buy those other backpacks as well because they just all look cool. And maybe if I buy enough from you, you'll set up a shop just like the Mabel sisters did. Um, I just, I didn't know you were around. All right, town backpack, yep, 1,040 bells, we'll get that. So that's really cool that he's just here. Nice to meet you, Kix. And then lastly, we have uh, this right here. Square backpack, yep, I'm buying. So there we go. Awesome, so three more backpacks. I won't be wearing all of those, but maybe we'll just spruce things up and wear different things at different times. And if you show up with different shoes, I'm not super into these, but I'll definitely uh, get some. Much obliged. Hi, Lionel. <laughs> What's up, Zebra? Uh, let's talk. I'm just out enjoying the cool breezes of Stripe. Speaking of breezes, I hear a balloon somewhere. Oh, here it is, here it is. Ready and got it. Okay, not bad. This is a present of some sort that has a bamboo doll. Well, I guess I'll learn that. Pretty cool. And let's talk to Lionel again, see if he has anything else to say. Uh, what's a good word? Is it precisely? Uh, what's the latest? Hey, you're really dressed up today. You headed to the after party? There's no before party that I know about, but I always ask everyone just in case. Ha <laughs> ha! I feel like his personality is a little different. Yo, you wanna chat? I don't blame you. Um, so I guess he does have a similar personality type to Kyle. Our new neighbor is here. I'm going to introduce myself, precisely. Should I lead with precisely or wait five minutes to start sprinkling it into a conversation? I think maybe wait a little bit. <laughs> okay, well there's that done. Lionel's of course a very interesting character and uh, we're just gonna keep moving for now. Oh, here's our first fossil spot finally. I missed it. Oh, yeah, we're still looking for the bagworm. And there's Pashmina fishing over there. So there's lots of people running around doing their stuff. It's pretty cool. Uh, let's get the, sl not the slingshot, the net. No, the net. There we go. Oh, we got more money. All right, I don't know why money is starting to fall out of trees all of a sudden, but I'm not complaining. Who's putting them up there? Okay. Not too much when it comes to a bagworm just yet. I'm sure sooner or later though it'll pop up. Because I swear they, they pop up quite often when I'm not looking for them, but now that I'm trying to find one, having a hard time with it. Those are, oh, oh, what is this? What? Pet food bowl. That's cool. I didn't realize that you could just get free stuff out of trees like that. That's awesome, maybe we should start shaking trees a little more often. Looks like Biff isn't home either. Nobody's home today. Everyone just running around enjoying the nice weather. Can't blame him, here he is. Afternoon, Squirt. You doing good? What's the latest? Muscle madness. Whew. I heard shouting is a great way to work out the apps. I also heard my neighbors were complaining. <laughs> All right, Biff. Uh, so there we go, we've talked to enough neighbors to uh, get ourselves something. Okay, there's all the trees in this area sh shaken, not stirred. Uh, let's go ahead and get 400 miles right there. So now we need to chop some wood. Uh, that might be fine. Actually, that'd probably be a more productive way to do this, because I'm pretty sure the, the bag room will still fall down. Well, there we go. Start working on this a little bit and see what we can get out of it. But I'll definitely talk to Pashmina in a moment, once I get over to her. Yeah, just trying to get as much done as productively as we can as soon as we can. But yeah, it's really cool to see Kix. I really do hope that we can maybe catch up with him more often. Because, I don't know, he seems pretty cool to me. 
And if he has his own shop, that'd just be really cool. Anyways, there's that done. So we get that Nook Miles. I definitely want to stack up as many Nook Miles as I possibly can in today's episode. Since we're going to island so much, oh, capturing a memory should be easy. So let's see that. Oop, there we go. And that is right there. Okie doke. Uh, catch a crawfish. Now that, I think I've, I've caught a crawfish in the past, but we'll find out eventually. Uh, hi, Pashmina. Wonder what kind of fish I'm gonna meet today. Hope they're nice. Me too. <laughs> we'll be catching our own fish a little bit later once we have uh, to do that with Miles. So I'm not really seeing too much. Maybe the bagworms don't fall when, when you hit it with an ax. I mean, it could just be that we haven't run into a bagworm yet. But I just, I, I don't really quite know. Anyways, we'll run that back down this way because we still have to hit these rocks with our shovel. So let's get started with that. Right there and right there. Now let's get to it. Okay, just normal rock. But we'll get what we can out of it. So it's right now it's just sort of doing the daily to-dos. What's interesting is we don't have any flowers. Are we gonna get a rock every single time? Wow. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever seen that happen before. That's crazy. But um, yeah, there was no flowers or no fruit trees. Usually there's at least one or the other, but I guess it just didn't sync up that way too well. Even Biff is fishing now. Everybody's keeping busy, I like it. Save some fish for me. I do need some for later. I'm sure there's plenty of fish in the sea, as they say. But hey, if too many people start fishing, it really could be a problem. But you always gotta be careful. Everything in moderation, right? Anyways, there we go, we got all this stuff. I know I, I went down by the beach and I saw Biff, but there's still some stuff to catch here. There we go, got that shell. And I guess that means we're good to go over this way. I did see that one fossil spot up that way, which we'll definitely get to, but in the meantime, go closer to the beach, might as well take some advantages. Okay, not too much over there. Aha, here's our message in the bottle. I'll happily grab that. Oh, and here's another fossil spot. Thank you. Oh wait, I missed. <laughs> Whoops, there we go. Oh, and there goes our shovel. That's not good. So I will have to come back with a new shovel then. But uh, now might be a good time to check our Nook Miles again. What other things can I get done? Um, still looking for the bagworm, still looking for fish and DIY stuff. Okay, so really not too much crazy going on there. So I guess now might be a good of a time as ever to go and organize my inventory a bit and sell what I have so that I can go and buy a new shovel then. Because <laughs> I'm a little low catch at the moment after buying all those bags. Okay, so we're home now. There's a couple of things I want to do. Uh, first off, I want to go and register this KK Slider song. Then I want to go to my wardrobe and um, equip ourselves a uh, our bag that we bought. But we should just be able to register. And this was what? KK Soul, cool, so we'll listen to this one now. Very relaxing. I love it when it's stereo like that, it's just really cool. We should probably set one of those up in another room as well, just so we can have some constant jams going on no matter where we are. That would be cool, but for right now, it's wardrobe time. I want to switch over to um, that bag. I've, I've been wearing this bag for a while, so definitely I think I've had my fill with it, but over this way, oh, I like it. I thought there would be more to the side, but I still think it looks cool, but we also have this bag and this bag. I like this one, though. So we'll keep, no, hold on. <laughs> I always forget it doesn't work that way. Uh, <laughs> try again. Get over this way, perfect, um, and change. Nice. Okay, so with that done, I need to uh, get this message in a, bo message in a bottle. Uh, this new DIY recipe was inspired by a scene in a novel I'm reading right now and really enjoying. I wanted to get my idea out into the world, so I put it in a bottle. My recipe is, is yours to try now. Okay, so wooden mosaic wall. <laughs> Interesting recipe, but uh, we got it now. So now I'll be going back to Timmy and Tommy and just selling a couple of items and getting a new shovel. Okay, so here we are at Nook's Cranny. We'll be able to see what's available. There's a tub over there, wow. Okay, but first I gotta sell some stuff. Uh, I wanna sell. Uh, so we have ourselves coral, oranges, shells, and a bug or two. So nothing too crazy. It's not a lot of money, but I, I need to be here anyways to buy the shovel back. Uh, and like maybe I should buy one of the axes as well, just so that I have one, because I know that's inevitably going to break, because we've been using it a gun chunk. But right now, outdoorsy shovel. Sounds good to me. 
I don't think I've seen this uh, fishing rod. This is just a fish fishing rod and a star net and then the elephant water can. So I guess there are sometimes, you know, just specialty things like that. But we'll also just buy a flimsy axe that I'll upgrade myself if I need to. There we go. And I'll leave it be with that. I will take a look at what you have for right now, even though I can't afford too much of it at the moment. Um, we have a candle. Nothing too crazy with this. Uh, no, I didn't I didn't mean to, whoops, okay, I guess I have a candle now. Um, we also have an hourglass, 660 bells. I will pass, I don't, I don't, don't need it. I have a clock, I'm fine with that. Uh, this, I think is a musical amp. It's an effects rack. Um, I think for audio effects, specifically. Pretty cool, pretty expensive as well. I don't think I need this, even though it would be cool. I don't know, I'll keep it in mind. I'll keep it in mind for sure. Um, we already have that table, uh, but this is a very fancy tub. Shower booth. So I guess it's a shower, not a tub. That is so nice, but it's 110,000 bells. I, I don't need that. <laughs> I don't need the, a, a shower that is the price of a home remodeling right now. Um, maybe at some point. Maybe at some point, but not now. So yeah, now that I got the new shovel and the ax, I'm gonna head back over to where we were and just continue on with what we were doing. So here we are again. Let's get started with this rock real quick and then we'll go to that one fossil spot I know of. There's a good couple of things to do still. So just trying to keep up with it all. Yeah, we got a couple of iron nuggets, which I'll definitely use on my one flimsy ax when the time comes, but that's not now. Okay, so far so good. And in the last episode was, I think, we also got up to the two star rating. I wonder if that's gonna improve at all. If, you know, as we get more villagers, maybe we can get one more. We'll get up to three stars, maybe. That would be cool. Uh, for right now, though, let's uh, bury that away immediately. I might have to dig this up. It might be in the way. Uh, I'll just assume that it is and get rid of it. So one, two, and three. That'll also get us a uh, couple pieces of wood. So that's nice. Thank you. Oh, hey, Celia. How are you? You surprised me. So, Zebra, how's your campaign to get KK to notice our island going so far? Not too bad. Here's something else for you. Oh, okay, thank you. I found something that might help you promote Stripe, a pond stone. Oh, that would be so nice. Thank you, you're the best. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. How are you doing, by the way? Everything okay, Feathers? Let's talk. Is it true that you tried to pull up every last weed on the island yesterday, Zebra? Yeah, and I, I did a pretty good job. It's too bad they pop back up again so fast, Feathers. Hey, if you ever see one, feel free to take it off the ground if you want. Give me some help. <laughs> Anyways, let's take a look at this pond stone. Wow, okay. We could put that near the well up, up there. That'd be a nice little place for it. Anyways, I know of this fossil spot, so this is fossil number three for us. Hoping that there's more than four today, but who knows. And... Apple is home, so let's go ahead and talk to her. You can always tell because their window. If the curtain is open, um, that means they're home. If the window's closed, or the, the, the curtain in the window's closed, that means that they're not home. Hi. Hey there, welcome to my humble abode, Cheekers. Let's chat. You were fishing a whole bunch yesterday, right? Could you maybe give me some fishing tips later? I'm squig squeaked out by fish bait, so I stand by the river and sing, but the fish always swim away. Yeah, maybe they're a little scared by that. Hi there. What do you need? Let's talk. Somebody moved in today. Have you already said hi? I want to meet them too. <laughs> All right then, let's go and say hi to uh, Rolf. They should be up on the incline. Maybe they're still at their house at the moment, not really sure. But, don't think there's anything else going on around here. But yeah, it's cool to, that we'll be able to meet Rolf. It's cool that we met Kix. Here's some more weeds. Get rid of those for sure. But I don't see too much else going on in terms of, uh, fossil spots at the moment. But we'll just go ahead and put this pond stone here by the pond. I feel like it doesn't fit. It's like a little bit too like detailed in a way compared to everything else around it. It's a little weird, like the art style doesn't match. I know I still need to donate to that thing. That's really just there for, uh, just to keep me in mind with it, you know? So yeah, I like Rolf's house. It's like this cool little shack made out of bamboo and stuff. And here he is, whoa, it is icy in here. No, no, that's not ice, that's stones. Okay, and wow, look at the view. You got like a nice piece of home away from home here. Look who it is, Zebra, it's me, Rolf. You were the one who inspired me to move myself here, remember? On the, back on this island? I can't wait to catch up with you as soon as I can manage to finish settling in. 
Yeah, it'll be nice. Well, let me keep talking to you until you repeat it yourself. Try to get caught up on this here cleaning so I ain't got the time to jaw today. Come back later. Oh, be waiting on me. I wanna be at this for a while yet. So I think he'll be moved in tomorrow. Well, this ain't coming together like I hoped. Maybe I, if I put this over there, I'm sorry, it. God, how long you been standing there? Did you hear me just now? Well, this kind of stuff ain't normally in my wheelhouse, but don't you worry, I'll get there. <laughs> All right, well, good luck, Roth. I hope you enjoy the town. I'll definitely talk to you again in an upcoming day at some point so that we can see uh, how everything's going with your house. I haven't seen the inside of uh, Lionel's house either, I don't think, but uh, can't right now, he's not home. He's out in town square, probably still singing his little heart out. So is there any fossil spots up this way? That's the question I'm trying to answer now. Got that. It's not looking like it. So unless there's something out over here. <laughs> I gotta fix this, I know. I, it was. It's all temporary. If I could just get the three stars, I'd be happy with that. But for right now, I don't see too much going on over this way. I know that there is the one last rock over here. Well, the, not the last rock. We still haven't done the one by Gigi's house, but not what I need. There we go. So yeah, let's try this again. And see what we get. We're getting some iron nuggets, some rocks, <laughs> lots of rocks. But that must mean the one by Gigi's house is the money rock then. So we'll have to be prepared for that. Either that or there's just no money rock today, which would be a bit of a bummer. But in the meantime, we'll still adventure near Gigi's house. Like I said, there's still sort of the orchard over that way. So we'll have to see that and see if there's any um, extra fruit trees there that still need to be attended to. Yeah, no red today. I wasn't expecting it since there was one yesterday. And there's not too much going on around here. Okay. I tried, I tried. <laughs> Couldn't find too much more. And what about by the camp? Not too much yet. We should get more bamboo while we have the chance though. Because with the bamboo, there's more and more recipes popping up for stuff. So I just want to build up a good collection before, you know, I really start needing some stuff, you know? So there is some of that. We got some of the normal bamboo, some of the light bamboo. Okay, and then we have one more or two more after this. I noticed that at first, when we first planted these bamboo, uh, more shoots were starting to pop up, but they haven't since. I was expecting, or at least hoping for more, because once you grow those, up oh, there it goes, I was waiting for it. Once you grow those, they um, they sell for a lot. So if you ever find another bamboo island, that's always something to you know take advantage of. So I'll use this flimsy ax for now. We will have to upgrade it, which I'll do the next time we swing by our house. It's right over there anyways. But there we go, I was I was waiting for that to happen. So it's not too much of a surprise. And here is another fossil spot. Is this our third or our fourth one? It's our fourth, okay. So that's probably the last fossil of the day. But the apples are growing in magnificently. I do need to change where these flowers are though. I'm not really as big of a fan of this as I originally was. I mean, I only put these here so I had, I think I was just getting done like a daily challenge or something, one of the Nook Miles. So I'll put these somewhere else. And one more, there we go. Looks like none of these fruit trees are ready to be picked right now. But we do have a couple of shells. And then we gotta go fishing as well. Okay, so right about there. Gonna turn around and get some money. Yeah, awesome. So let's hope we make a good amount from this. But Gigi isn't home either. The only person who was home today was Rolf. That's weird. Oh, and Apple. Apple was home. But here we go. This is like the most amount of money we've made today. This hasn't been too much recently. But that certainly helped with the 17,000. And there's Gigi. Hi, Gigi, how are you? There you are, Rebet, and looking fabulous as ever, I see. Oh, thank you. I want to chat. My dear, isn't this weather divine? I tell you, clear skies like this make me feel like anything is possible. I agree. It's always nice for nice weather to be invigorating. Uh, why is there something I can help you with, Rebet? Uh, goodness, have you met the new neighbor yet, Rebet? I have not. First impressions are very important. I really must find something fabulous to wear before introducing myself. I mean, Rolf is a pretty easygoing guy. I don't think he'll even really notice too much. Not because of you, but just because, you know, he just seems to be a little bit aloof. 
Anyways, there is another balloon. Let's hope this one has some money for us because that's usually what the yellow balloon means. Uh, yeah, 5,000 bells. Well, thank you very much. So I'm going to very quickly go ahead and upgrade our ax and then we'll donate the uh, fossils that we have. That'll be another daily milk miles too. Um, so let's craft. And actually, no, no, okay, that's what I meant to do. I just then pressed the wrong button. What are you doing? There we go. Okay, well, let's craft, go to tools, and there we go. Oh, do I not? Oh, I need wood. I, I don't know why I always think I need a an iron nugget for that. I don't. I just need normal wood, so <laughs> let's just try to get some more then. And there we go. I definitely need to start building out my collection of wood a bit more. It just takes time, really. And more direct effort than I usually am willing to give it. Can you stop? <laughs> Thank you. It's already a stump. Not too much more wood to knock out of it. Okay, this time, we're good. Awesome. So now I have another ax for uh, continual building. And that is favorited, very nice. So let's go over to Blathers again. We already donated one thing to him earlier today with the painting. Now we have four fossils for him. I can only hope that as per usual, at least one of these um, is, a, is a new fossil for the museum. But beyond that, if we make money off the other ones, it's pretty cool too. So assess fossils. And we're just gonna do that with these four. So what do we get? Ah, oh, darn. Okay, so he has all of them. So we're just gonna sell those. <laughs> so before we sell anything, because we don't know what kind of uh, challenge we'll be getting next, let's go ahead and get this. That's an extra 300 miles for us. And now it's just catching bugs, fish. You get the deal, so we'll definitely be doing that. But first, let's sell to uh, Timmy and Tommy so that we can have the extra inventory space to actually do all that kind of thing. All right, hello. So, I wanna sell, hopefully, usually four fossils will make us somewhere between 10 and 20,000 bells, but it really depends on what they are. This time we have a Brachioskull, Ammonite, uh, Terra Body, and Iguanodon Tail. And that's 14, see, I told you, 14,000 bells. Um, not too bad. I didn't see if there was anything else I wanted to sell, though. I think there might be, at least a couple of shells. Uh, Actually, yeah, just one shell. That's all I need to sell. Okay, so I'll, I'll put the rest of the stuff away in my inventory, and then we will be back to uh, start fishing. So let's see what we can fish up today. Hopefully something cool, but there's not anything too crazy I'm looking for at the moment. Um, but I'm sure we'll run across something. Maybe there'll be new stuff. We've been catching a lot of new fish recently, though, so if I don't find anything new, not gonna be too upset by it. <laughs> like I said, the new season's coming up. Um, summer's coming up in Animal Crossing and in real life, so it's gonna be fun to uh, see what new fish might start appearing with all that. Anyways, here's a small one. But we're looking for a crawfish. I don't know if we can find one of those in the ocean. I think that's a pond fish, so might have to change up where we're going if we wanna do that. But for right now, I'm not too worried about that. And if we see any bugs as well, we can capture those, because that's another Nook Miles. At this point, for the rest of today's episode, since we've done most of everything else I wanted to do, I just want to sort of get a bunch of Nook Miles so that I think starting next episode, I'll be going back out to more islands. It's just a matter of I'm not making two to 4,000 miles a day. So I don't want to do it every episode because I'm just going to run out eventually. There we go. But I might as well, on the days that I'm not, make sure I'm getting extra miles so that we can keep it going. But it was very fun meeting with Kix there. I really am curious to see if he has his own shop, because I've not heard of him at all before. So I don't know if he was new. Was there an update that was snuck in that I was just not aware of? Who knows? But oh, look at this, we got a dace. We get one of those quite often, so it's not that surprising, but hey, we got it. Let's see, over this way, not too much going on. I'll make my way up to where there's a pond. I think there's a pond near Gigi's house, right? Maybe. Oh yeah, there is, by the bamboo and stuff. I almost forgot. There we go. And we'll see if we can't get a crawfish out of that. Here is another horse mackerel, or crucian carp, whatever. <laughs> I get them because it's a pretty similar looking fish. Okay, so yeah. Back over this way, uh, we have the pond, which right now does have a little fish inside of it. Oh, I got your attention too. Okay, not bad. 
Whoa, it's a frog again. Okay, so we've, we've gotten a frog. Don't choke the Gigi, that'd probably upset her greatly. Um, but <laughs> I do think it's cool that we got that out of the way. So maybe we can sell that and see how much it sells for, because I haven't before. Hmm. But we'll keep swinging by that little pond and see if we can't get a crawfish at some point, because I'm pretty sure the one time we got a crawfish was from there. Unless I'm misremembering entirely. But here's a tiny little fish. This is probably a seahorse, if I had to guess. Yep, got it. Anything else on this side of the ocean? That's already five fish. That happened real quick. That happened really quick. So there's 300 miles for us. We do need to craft two more things, and then our daily doubles are done. We can earn bells by selling items. We can catch four more bugs. If I see any more bugs, I'll certainly go for them. But in the meantime, why don't we get more fish caught? If we can find any of those too. Oh, here we go. Right over this way. Oh, and there's a little butterfly flying around, so I'll go for you in just a moment. This is probably just a black bass, so nothing too exciting about it. But it's always good to get it. Come on. Ooh. Especially if we're trying to make, you know, a good couple of thousand of bells. We want to catch as many fish as we can. In the meantime, though, let's get our colorful net. Wait, where did it go? Oh, here it is. <laughs> it was trying to get away, I feel bad. There we go, blue bottle. So we need to catch three more bugs. There's really not too much going on when it comes to the uh, the pond fish here. So maybe we could go to the other ponds higher up. Oh, I do see this fish. Ready? Oh, that might not be, yeah. Maybe like that instead. But I do think that our backpack that we got from Kix is really tying her outfit together. I really do like just getting a good variety of shoes though. So I'm really hoping that Kix shows up, you know, every, at the same day every week. Because if he does, that makes it a whole lot easier for me to figure out when he's gonna be here. Um, okay, I guess I was too slow with that one. That was weird. Yeah, I'll try my best with that. We'll see how it goes. Oh, there's another one. Of the, oh, I really don't like these guys. Oh, well, first off, let's get you. Oh, I missed. Not this time now. Yeah, that's dragonfly for us. It's a darner dragonfly. We have these. Okay, and there's you too. <laughs> okay, now all the bugs are showing up. Got another pond skater. And a common butterfly. <laughs> there we go. What happened to that water bug though? Here he is. Is he gonna hop on this side? I don't think so, so I might have to get over to him. Because I think these things, I mean, not in the game, but in real life, I'm pretty sure they can fly too. I don't like them. <laughs> They're creepy. Um, It's a diving beetle. Okay. So, with that out of the way, let's go ahead and get our Nook Miles. Uh, and this is gonna be a simple 150, but good to get out of the way. We're up to 36,000. Changing our wardrobe, that'll be easy. Um, catching a bagworm, I've still not had the chance to do, so maybe we could start working with that a little bit. Just shake some more trees and see what we can find. Because that's really, oh no, here we go, here we go. No, 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 what are you doing? I was trying to swing my net, and of course my character's like, ooh, shake tree! <laughs> no, that's not what I wanted. Ah, uh, luckily our sunglasses hide it, but geez, we could have sold that. That really does stink, because obviously in that situation, the last thing I want to do is shake the tree some more. You know, it's just very silly. I feel like I, I would like it if there was like a, once a day you could skip a Nook Miles. If if I could, I would definitely skip the Bagworm one. This is because it's just a bit tedious to do, really. Anyways, we've caught enough stuff that I could probably make a good profit off of. I don't know about 5,000 bells, but we can close. And we also still haven't checked out the Able Sisters or the Town Center, so I guess I, guess I can do those things now too. Um, so yeah, we'll just try to do a little bit of everything. <laughs> Hi guys. So, I wanna sell. I'm going to sell you basically everything I've gotten here. Yep, seems good. Over 5,000? Almost, darn. That would've been great for, it was only 4,295. So we need to get about 705 more. And then we will have uh, that challenge done. So in the meantime, Let's check to see uh, what's going on in the town center. Right over this way. Oh, <laughs> right over this way. <laughs> uh, maybe there's some lost and found stuff. If there is, we'll definitely sell it. More than just the rusted pieces that are sometimes here. So rusted part, I'll, I'll just get these because they're always sitting here. Um, cardboard box again. Nothing too crazy. 
And in here, what do we got going on? Yep, 150 bonus miles, that's cool. Glad I didn't forget to do that. Is there anything else I wanna redeem though? Not looking like it. Okay. But there might be stuff in the daily shop. It seems like less and less there are stuff. Like really at this point, it's just a KK slider stuff because we have the radio. We don't need these clothing options. KK cruising, I don't think I have this one, but I never know. So I might as well just spend it just to be safe. Um, and I will donate, or not donate, but deposit some of my money. Um, there we go, that should be good for now. So our 471, we're really closing in on paying that off and having another upgraded house. Uh, or another upgrade to our house, really. Awesome, so I don't have too much money to spend, but I'm sure we can go over to the Able Sisters and get something. And if we get any more money today, we can spend that there too. But I'm glad we were able to put away a good 32,000 into our thing today. Shows we made some progress, you know. And some days are just simply more profitable than others because of how the fruit grows in. Um, just some days we'll just make a lot more money. Hello. Uh, hey there, welcome to the Able Sisters. Yep, we are just gonna go into here. It's always the easier way to check things out. And let's see what we got. So we got the Acid Watch jacket still, the Explorer shirt, um, fitness tank, we've seen that. Humble sweater, that is pretty humble. Uh, this one, tennis sweater, a little less humble. A uh, thread-worn sweater, so I guess this one has like holes in it, but like designer holes. Uh, the acid wash jeans, denim cutoffs, uh, embroidered floral skirt, the jogging shorts we've seen, forest print dress, suspender outfit, wow, this is a full outfit. Interesting. Uh, and we also have dotted shower cap for that, you know, freshly clean look. Wide brim straw hat, oh, these are fancy. Uh, Bubble gum, yeah, we've seen those. Okay, food mess, which is sort of gross as having spaghetti on your face, a pacifier. Um, tights, which you cannot see with my current outfit. Uh, different kinds of socks, different kinds of shoes. I think we've seen these. Yeah, these are high-tech sneakers, loafers, winkle, win winkle pickers, work boots. So honestly, not too much new today. I mean, it's bound to happen. I'm sure I'm not their only customer, but I don't know how many they can possibly have with only, you know, nine or 10 other residents. So, you know, it probably takes time for them to go through all their inventory. So yeah, there, there's uh, the Town Center and the Able Sisters for today. And yeah, what are my chances of getting some other Nook Miles done? We can change our wardrobe at the wardrobe thing. Um, I still need to catch a little bit more money worth of stuff. So we will keep fishing uh, and catching bugs and doing all of that just because it is pretty easy money just to stack up real quick. Oh, there goes my net though. Oh no. <laughs> so maybe it is a very easy money right now. Also, I do need to craft some things. What are some things I can craft right now with what I have? I don't have too much at the moment. Um, I really don't have too much right now. Uh, alphabetical, order obtained series. Okay, so there isn't like a craft craftable order. I wish there was. I could craft a cardboard chair with my cardboard box. You know what? All it is is literally putting the flap up. I might as well do that. There we go. Keep crafting. I just need to craft one more thing. I don't know if I have anything in my inventory to really do any good crafting at the moment though. Uh, but what I might do is I might just really quickly go get some wood or something. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, we'll have to wait and see. I've never crafted this before. Yeah, I might want to just try, I never crafted an ocarina, we need more clay. We should do that. Yeah, we should for sure do that because that's another instrument I can have laying around. <laughs> but yeah, let's do that for right now. So I have three clay in my inventory already, apparently, yeah, from the uh, lost and found, I remember now. And I will make a little bit more once I find out where the clay is. Here it is, so we just need the smaller stack of them. And let's really quickly craft that, that'll be cool. Come on. I don't know why it's being picky with me, but there we go. Let's craft them. Then we'll also change our wardrobe real fast. Uh, craftable, awesome. This is cool. Yeah, we got this pretty early on. I just never had the chance to check it out. Oh, it has a cool little bag. Don't know what's up with that. Um, so yeah, Ocarina. Oh, is it in one of my slots right now? I guess it took over the slot of something. I like it. And we can just hold a note.
That's pretty cool. All right, awesome, so we made that. We can also change our wardrobe real quick. Uh, I'll keep it simple. I'll change into that. And we'll, maybe we'll change back. But it should be Nook Miles done. I'm pretty sure that was what we had. Uh, there we go. So, let's find out. Uh, yep, so we got 150 there. And we got 300 here. Very good. So not really too much more. Some of this is a little bit more obscure. Spend balls to buy items. I wish this was around sooner, but uh, did we get some long-term miles as well? No, I guess not. Okay, so I'll put this away in the music room if I can. I don't know if it gives me the option to put it down. Because it would also make for like a nice little piece just to, you know, sit around here. Put away. Place item. There we go. Cool, it'll just sit there on the floor for right now. Shouldn't be too big of a deal. Okay, so with that done, I will just continue to catch more fish and stuff until we have at least a couple more, you know? It's just so that I can get um, the bells I need to finish that one Nook Miles, because if not, that'll go away. I don't want that. If we're so close to completing it, we might as well just get it done. So let's see, oh, here's a tiny little fish. In the river, that's not super common, so I hope that whatever this is, we can uh, catch it. Maybe not. Okay. Whoop. There we go. Don't get too excited. There we go. It's a rock. Of course it's a rock. Not like we're you know just trying to finish up for the day and they're giving us rocks now. Yeah, I can't catch any of the fish without a net, so or, not, or any of the bugs without a net. So I'm just gonna leave that be. This better not be another rock. It's a little bigger this time. It'd be a bigger rock. Oh, okay, we got a um, a freshwater goby. That's cool. Uh, anything down this way by the opening or in the ocean? I feel like there's, now that I'm specifically trying to get fish, there are significantly less fish around. Why does it always have to be that way? And you can't sprint around to look for them because then they get scared and they, they swim away. This is very likely another seahorse. We'll find out. Come on now. You got it. Yep, seahorse. Seahorses are very common this time of year, apparently. And let's see, because we're, we're so close. It's just, I don't know how much these fish cost, but if I assume they cost like two or 300 each, yeah, we still should probably capture about two more. Oh, I see one over this way. Don't think it's a seahorse, but I don't know what it actually is. I think it's slightly bigger. Come on, come on. Okay, what are you gonna be? It is a horse mackerel. Okay, one more fish and then we'll be all done. Anything in the river? Okay, this is probably another dace. Hope you don't mind me fishing right next to you, Gigi. Try not to hit you with a fish. It's a daze, I caught it! Oh, she's very impressed. Okay, so let's go, ooh, I don't have a net. <laughs> Gotta remember that. Oh well. But we'll buy another one. If I can buy two things, because I think they're both 2,500 each, or all the top tools are. So if I buy that and maybe like another fishing rod, that should be good. All right, hey, hey you two. I wanna sell. Let's hope this is enough. So definitely just gonna get rid of all of that. Okay, very nice. Actually more than I was expecting. I will gladly take that. Now moving over this way, buy some tools back and we'll be all finished up for today. Um, I'll buy a fishing rod because I'm sure we're running out of durability for hours. And then finally, another net. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so there we go. Plenty of Nook Miles earned up in today's episode so that if we want to, we can go island exploring in the next episode or just in an upcoming episode in general. That'll be really cool. But for right now, I think that's gonna wrap it up for today's episode. Let's just make sure we grab our Nook Miles. Right there, 150. And then another 200 right over here. 
awesome. So, of course, e you know, more easy stuff is going to pop up. I'm going to leave it be for right now. That is going to wrap it up for today's episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.